all right guys hey i wanted to just show y'all uh some of the uh benefits of having these little uh handheld tuners this here is the uh, uh diablo intune this is going to be the older the older model here i got it hooked up to the 14 charger um, one of the benefits of these here is uh doing the custom tuning um and uh basically doing a data log and uh sending the information off to a uh a, a tuner and then he can uh, uh um, configure you a tune and email it back to you and uh this is basically how you would go about that um basically what you would do is you uh you know drive your car you know somewhere out safe you know preferably mexico <laughs> uh where nobody's around uh country road and um basically what you want to do is uh hook your hook your tuner up and um you're going to come up here and go to scan tool and then up at the top you're going to see data logging so you click on that and the first thing what i did is you go down here to uh configure and then go to the the gauge mode and what i did is i clicked on uh, formatted text it shows you more a little bit more information that you can go on to so i'll go back And then um, here, uh, basically what you do, but you click uh, record. Building list, um, ensure vehicle is on, engines running. And this is your basically your data. It's actually recording engine data. And what you would do now is you would... Uh, make uh, uh make a couple of uh, wide open throttle pulls and um once you're done with the wide open throttle pulls you basically go uh back and then here it says save what you would do is you would uh click the the check and save it and then what you can do is it comes with a cable you hook it up to your laptop and you can download this file onto your laptop and send that file off to a, a tuner you know some guy like uh, Jonah or Hemi Fever some one of those guys like that and that's basically how how that would work um, but we'll go back to the to the list of the little features here they have um, a lot of this stuff in here is kind of over my head um the tuner guys would definitely know what a lot of this stuff is you can go down through here it's got uh your spark your base spark this is with the engine idling here i'm just sitting here idling um air temperature sensed map barometric uh, injector air charge your short time or your, your short fuel trim it's got your long your long fuel trims in here short one and two I know I do know these here the the uh, the short the uh, fuel trims basically it's got a, a negative and positive number anytime when the number is negative uh, the engines going to basically be uh, cutting fuel and anytime when it goes into a positive it's going to be adding fuel battery voltage open loops See, some of the stuff I don't know desired FA it's basically got a lot of information this is be for your knock your knock sensors vehicle speed engine RPMs your throttle your throttle position she's saying it's five five percent throttle position so I can rev it up and the th you see the throttle position open about 30 yeah they're about 34 percent and so basically when you're done you just you know click off that and, and you would save 
and then you would send that off to your tuner and most of those guys have you uh, create a couple of, of files like they'll send you one at one at idling and uh, send you one at like a part throttle cruise and a wide open throttle and those guys can go through that data and they can uh, create you a tune for um, you know if you add uh, once you add mods and, and you change mods and you put another mod on you can go back and usually get that guy to uh, retune your car a little better but that's definitely one of the benefits from these tuners here over like the the scat pack P PCM you can actually data tune and, and, and do stuff like that so it's it's a pretty little cool tool all right guys We'll uh we'll check y'all later.